Capacitive deionization CDI, is an electrochemical water treatment technology used for removing ions, particularly salt ions, from water. It operates on the principle of electrostatic adsorption and desorption of ions onto the surface of porous electrodes. The basic component of a CDI system is the capacitive deionization cell. A CDI cell consists of two porous electrodes typically made of activated carbon or another suitable material. These electrodes are separated by an ion permeable separator or membrane. When a voltage is applied across the two electrodes, positively charged ions, cations, are attracted to the negatively charged electrode, cathode, while negatively charged ions, anions, are attracted to the positively charged electrode, anode. This process is known as ion adsorption. The ions are stored on the surface of the porous electrodes, which have a high surface area due to their porous nature. This is similar to how charge is stored in a traditional capacitor, hence the name, capacitive deionization. TES makes CDI cell specification are listed. The cell specifications and working area of cell can be customized according to user requirement. Hi everyone, my name is Raja Subramani. Today we are going to see a capacitive deionization cell. This is the cell. In this video, we are going to see assembly of CDI cell and disassemble. The static pump. The peristatic pump goes to inlet of the CDI cell. And in between you have uh, the membrane um, assembly image. Then you have outlet. Okay. Now I'm going to switch on the peristatic pump with the minimal speed. And the peristatic pump is on. Now the electrolyte is going in and comes back with the outlet. And you can able to see it's going back to the another electrolytic tank. So this uh, phase static pump is having the capacity from 10 ml to 50 ml per minute. Okay, so we'll increase the speed, and you can also see the flow rate. Now it's running with the maximum speed. We just wanted to make sure that there won't be any leak in the cell. There is no leak in the cell. So it's performing good on the higher speed. Now we can see this assemble of CDA cell. Connect collector goes inside. Uh, 
and you have a gasket. This gasket. This is your GDO. GDO will go here, like this. Then you have a membrane. 